Hey guys, Tom Desmond, Apricot Law, and this is the video about trustworthiness and authority of websites. Some of you said that sounds crazy, which I agree, but it's true. Some websites are stronger than others. And here's that tool that I was telling you about that measures strength and trustworthiness of websites. Uh, for today's phrase, it's Tampa. As you know, it could be anywhere in the United States. Uh, match with car accident, lawyer is going to be a uh, valuable phrase. This particular phrase is $352 for one click. And I know you guys don't want to spend that, so that's crazy. Anyway, the, um, the best traffic is organic, and that's what we're going to talk about, ranking organically. So um, it really does come down to numbers. It's not magic. Everything can be measured. And these numbers, what these numbers and what these tools are measuring are backlinks and the trustworthiness and the strength of those backlinks because it's not really the quantity of the backlinks, it's the quality. And this, these tools measure quality. It measures both, but we're going to look at quality. So before I take a deeper look, I'm going to just explain a couple of these numbers. They're all kind of important, but we're just going to pick the best ones that are have the biggest impact on rankings. So TF, that's trust flow. It's a, just what it sounds like. It's the trustworthiness of this page that's in the number one spot. Uh, as a result of the trustworthiness of the websites linking to it. So a backlink is a little text link on another website within the content someplace that links to your website. That's a backlink. I know you know that, but I just like to cover all the bases. Um, and if you have a lot of trusted websites linking to you, your trust number goes up and, web, and Google promotes trusted websites. So this number is a, it's a measurement from one to 100, 100 being the highest. And this particular uh, website, the home page is a 55, which is tremendously high for this market. But the page we have to rank is a 13, which is actually pretty low. So we, we're not trying to beat the, the website, the whole website's trust flow. We just have to beat the ranking page, which is a 13. These boxes here, th this is called topical trust flow. And that, that means that um, every link that's coming into your site gets a little label and categorized by topic. And the most powerful type of website is a society slash law topical trust flow, meaning that the topic of that website is law. It's a law related. And there's thousands of different topics. So you'll see the websites that have links from you know adult or uh, entertainment or food or shopping or whatever. There's, there's a thousand different topics. You want law and society links. This number here is very interesting because this is a, this is, like I said, this is a powerful site. There's 74,000 links coming into this site as a whole. Now, I have to say it again, we're not trying to beat that. We just want to rank for car accidents in whatever location you're in. We have to beat this number, this 10. And it's, again, it's not the number, it's the quality. And we're going to take a deeper look in a second. This number here is important. This is a, a different tool. This is Moe's um, page authority, PA, page authority. There's, it's a number from 1 to 100. There's a 34. Now, in this market, it's pretty good. We, like I said, we don't have to be in the 80s or 90s. This is, we're not grading things like we're in grammar school. You're not, you're not trying to get an A. You just have to, every phrase is going to have a different number that we're going to want to beat. All right, so let, let's take a look at the, the number two site and see. Now, as we scroll down, you'll see the numbers start to drop off. Um, but we just let's see the one, two, first and second sites. The trust flow is a 14 for this phrase, uh, in this page. Uh, again, you can see society and law and the is the predominant link, and it's a 20, which is pretty good. The page authority is a 31, a little lower than this one, so this site's a little stronger. And uh, the number of links coming into that internal page, according to this tool, Majestic, is 62. So you might think, well, why is uh, this site in the number two spot when it has way more links going into the internal page? We'll have to take a closer look. All right, so let's do that. I'm going to click this button here. And what it's going to do is open up that tool. So it's almost like taking this page and putting it under a microscope. We'll take a closer look. Now, this is a problem. This trust flow here, see it turn, it's, not, it's no longer purple because we're looking at the internal page, which means that the predominant link 
coming into the internal page is not law related. It's not a law link. And that's actually good news for the people of Tampa because this is not a hard site to beat. But let's keep going. Here's that 62, right? So that's the number of links going into that internal page. This is a more important number. This is referring domains. This, is, this means that there's eight different websites linking into that internal page. It's a more important number because like votes, it's more important to have more people referring to you as, as the authority rather than three people referring to you as their favorite 20 times each, right? So that, this is an important number. What I'm gonna do now is click referring domains and it's gonna take a deeper look at those actual eight domains. So we can see exactly what websites are linking into that internal page. And a, the, a website's strength or page's strength is only as good as the pages that the links are coming from, not the domain. So this is not even as deep as we can look. I'll, I'll show you that in a second. So when we take a deeper look at the, at the domains, we can see that the domains are not really law related. There's only one law related domain linking into that internal page. There's computers, business, reference, business, small business. Um, there are some directories, recreation, nothing to do with law. So again, this is not a hard site to beat, even though it's in the number two spot. Kind of why I'm doing this video, because um, I know a lot of you see these websites in the top three and the top five a lot, and it's intimidating. How do we? How do they get up there? How do we beat them? They probably spend fifty thousand dollars a month on this, and it's, what you're seeing is that it's really not such a big deal. So what I'm going to do now is click this little number one here, because it's the one society law link that they actually have going into that ranking page. And what it's going to do is pull up the actual page that the link is on, and we'll take a deeper look. So now we're seeing something different. Watch what happens. You might be familiar with this website. It might be, yeah. oh, it's an SEO legal website. So it's kind of an SEO company. But what, what I'm doing here is I'm, I'm gonna take a close look at the actual nutrition that this page is getting. Now we, we call it website nutrition because it, it's a great analogy. It's, uh, it's just like diet and food. Not all food is good for you. Some food makes you sick. Same thing with links. Not all links are good for your website. In fact, most are bad. But if you have good links coming into your website, your website is very, very strong. And it's easy to rank for anything you want at that point. So what I'm doing now is looking at, here's, the, here's Lorenzo and Lorenzo. So there's the actual link I'm rolling over. And I always say this, your website's nutrition is only as good as the page that that link is on uh, minus the other links on that page. So there's a lot of other links on the page sharing that nutrition you're not getting a lot of that power. You're not getting a lot of that juice. You can click out of that. And this tool here analyzes the amount of juice that this page is, is providing, right? Minus the other links on the page that are also sucking the juice out of the page. So what we're gonna see here is Trustflow is an 11, which is pretty low. That's not a strong site. The links coming into this page is only one. So this page, is not providing a lot of juice to Lorenzo and Lorenzo, just a tiny bit. The raw page authority, which is another number we talked about in the beginning of the video, is only a 15. So this is the raw value of, of this link minus the other links here that are also sharing that juice. All right, so the, that's how that's done. Now, what's an example of a really good link building? This is not a sales video, but I wanna show you something and I might as well use one of our, one of our clients. So Boston Car Accident Lawyer, um, here's our guy here. We'll do apples to apples. I'll click this same button and use the same tool to show you what it's supposed to look like and what it can look like. So here's his car accident page. You can see it's all law and society. There's that purple. The Trustful is a 39, which is tremendous in any market. 70 total links and 31 referring domains. So this, we got 31 different websites to link into that one internal page. And we, we link to all the pages on the site, but over time, you know, these numbers grow and website gets very strong. So it's 31, which is huge. Now I'll click that 
referring domains button so we can see the actual, oops, the actual nutrition. So we have just, I just want to call your attention to all the purple society slash law. One, two, I won't count them, but you, you see what I'm talking about. This is what a strong backlinking profile looks like, all these purple society and law. So how do you get those links? There's a lot of ways, <laughs> a lot of ways. There's law firm directories. There's thousands of them out there. There's only about 45 that are good. Some allow you to, or they let us publish content so we can maximize that power. We own a ton of websites and they're all law related and very well cared for. So that's a, another way. There's uh, guest posts. There's you know, other people own nice networks of trusted websites. And it's a matter of reaching out and, well, we have a whole department of people that do that, but you know, reaching out and making sure that the velocity is good, the anchor text is right, the trust flow is good, the, the, uh, the topic is on point, and that page authority um, has a nice number, truly shoot for 20 or above. And then we also make sure that those links, your link coming to your site is one of maybe three or four, not 10 or 12 or 15 or 100 other links on that page. So... If you are interested, and I know we talked about this, and a lot of you took advantage of it, and I, I'm really happy you did, uh, take advantage of the free website audit video. Go to the site, apricotlaw.com, and send your send the form in, and you'll get a, a video like this you know, with me or Kellen uh, analyzing your website and your, your direct competitors to see exactly what you have to do, what's going on with your linking, what's going on with their linking, and see how far you have to go to beat them. So take advantage of that. If you prefer to just talk to me on the phone, that's great. Call 212-960-8584. And I'll do an analysis like this right over the phone for you. I'm always sitting at these tools. So anyway, thanks for watching this one. Stay tuned to the next and we'll be in touch. All the best.